and welcome to another exciting edition of Badminton Unlimited. Coming up on the show, Cho Tian Chen tells us what he's been up to during the challenging period of self-isolation. While teammate Tai Tzu Ying relives her glorious wins in Malaysia and Singapore last year. And para badminton star Daniel Chan talks about his love for the sport. I trust badminton and I believe that if I am not quitting, badminton will not quit me, will, will not leave me. Chinese Because 醫院的同仁因為他們這個防疫已經很久了我觉得这方面很好吧所以我觉得这方面我会抓紧做好准备一个比赛大家一直在那种比较恐惧的状态下Chiu Tianchen won his first major title back in 2014 at the Yonex French Open. The then 24-year-old upset fifth seed Wang Zhengming to lift his maiden Super Series title, as well as Chinese Taipei's first ever men's singles Super Series title. That historic victory is our classic match this week. Oh, that's nice.
Good defence. That was brilliant backhand defence from Chao Tian Chen. Oh, lovely. Yeah, it was the change of pace, the first downward okay. shot from Five. the Chinese player. Yeah, that's clever from Wang Shiming. 21 10. Oh, that's loose. Good retrieving. Yeah. Force the error. No power for his opponent to feed off. Now, this is a very, very good spell from Chao Tian Chen. Beautiful. Ten all. Oh, round the back. Oh, unbelievable. Wang Shimin, look, round the back. Yeah, well played. Oh, that is the shot of the match so far. Oh, what a rally! And look at the reaction. Back level, 20 all. Well, that's only the second or perhaps the third time that I've seen Chao Tian Chen really take command of the front of the court. He's done it. It is one game all. Well, a real indication of the strength of this man's legs, Chao Tian Chen. Yeah, well tapped. Yeah, lovely angle. Brilliant defence. That's the second time in this match that Chao Tian Chen has played a remarkable cross-court backhand defensive shot, whipping it, doing a full pirouette at the end of it too, but totally deceiving. Yeah, there's the good movement. And again from his opponent. Oh, my word. Unbelievable. Oh. That's only the third time that I can remember that he's really pounced on the net play. But what a time to do it. Oh my goodness, he's got it back. He's missed it. And the unseeded Chao Tian Chen collapses on the floor the realisation that he has won the French Open Super Series title. And at his first attempt, he has won the title. It's almost too much for him to comprehend. At the Selkom Asiata Malaysia Open 2019, Tai Tzu Ying became only the third women's singles player to feature in a Super Series level final for four straight years, after India's Saina Newal and China's Wang Xian. The Chinese Taipei player was also gunning for her third straight title victory. But the trophy meant even more to Tai, having just recovered from an injury she suffered during the All England Open. <laughs> It's 
就是想要把成绩打得比较好，所以其实那时候算有照着呃练习的计划在走，所以其实就比较不担心自己在场上的发挥。对啊，那嗯、呃、发挥的也算还还 OK 吧。So the opening eight, twenty one, sixteen. That's what so many fans love watching Tai Su Ying because of those skills. Yes. And because she comes out with shots that very few other women singles players can play. Yeah. And Tai Su Ying becomes only the fourth women singles player since the inception of the Super Series to win either a Super Series or a Grand Prix Gold or World Tour title three consecutive times. 2017 was the last and only time Thai achieved the straights double, winning both the Malaysia and Singapore Open titles. In 2019, she found herself once more in the same position. Having won in Kuala Lumpur, she made the Singapore final looking for her second title of the season. Now, 放松一点，就是因为目标是去打比较重要的比赛。那到新加坡，其实第一场，我记得我第一场其实好像就已经要输了，因为很很累吧。就是我记得我那时候对过去的时候，我第一场好像打张贝文，对，然后我记得那时候我打到快输了，然后就想说啊，我要输了，然后就也觉得。没有关系，因为其实比赛还很多啊，对啊，那重要就是不要受伤，因为因为其实这个比赛这样子接续下来其实是蛮蛮辛苦的啦，对啊，有时候又会像前一阵子又打到决赛的输的人，可能下周二就要先开赛，这样子的时间有维持了一段时间，就那时候我觉得比较。没有那么好，因为这个赛赛制上可能会让选手非常的辛苦。Only needed the one, t w e n t y o n w n e t e e and the world number one wins her second title. Time for a short break here on Badminton Unlimited, but stay with us as we go back to the courts of Birmingham for a visual treat. And world number two Daniel Chan reveals how para badminton changed his life. In my normal life, I can move very smoothly, but when I sit on wheelchair on the badminton court, I like flying.
Daniel Chan Ho Yuan is widely recognized as one of the outstanding talents in para badminton. Ever since joining Hong Kong's para badminton team more than a decade ago, the men's singles WH2 star has built his success with an unwavering commitment to the sport. I cheat para badminton as my religion because it helped me to stand up, it helped me to have a little life. I trust badminton and I believe that if I am not quitting, badminton will not quit me, will, will not leave me. Badminton Unlimited had a chat with the world number two to find out how Para Badminton gave him a new lease of life. I was a passenger and the car accident came out. So, uh, so my Chinese New Year of, of that year, I stay in hospital, in ICU. When I wake up, I lost my left leg. I would call that, that period as my dark age. But luckily, Badminton saved me from, from that. One year, I got discharged from hospital and then I started to touch power of badminton, wheelchair badminton. In my normal life, I can move very smoothly, but when I sit on wheelchair on the badminton court, I like flying because nothing can limit your movement if you are in a sport wheelchair and holding your racket. So um, the feeling is really, really fantastic. So I, I know that at that moment, I would Give, I would give so many times into this sport. The Hong Kong wheelchair fencing team comes to me and invite if you are interested in fencing because I have long hand, it's easy for me to pick up. I'm very potential, I'm young. And because in Hong Kong, they never got a wheelchair badminton player. So if you develop a new sport in a place, it, it will be very, very difficult. No sparring partner, no experience, no equipment, and then no one can expect how high you can be. So when I say I would like to be the first one in Hong Kong, everybody think you are stupid, you are idiot. But now after 11 years, I proved that, okay, I'm right. Actually, i done what I want to be and I'm success. So I'm proud of my decision at that moment. My wife always appreciates me because uh, we know each other for over 20 years. So she knows what I was before my accident and she knows what I am today. So she always say that, okay, we are lucky and I am lucky that I have my accident and let me to be a bet better person. She is a very good friend for me to share. So uh, we talk every day, uh, big things, small things, positive things, dark things. I will share all the things, all the angles to her. So she is a good one to let me to give all my stress to her. So thank my wife always supporting me. With her support, I can only focus in my uh, sport career. It's the first ever time for Paralympic to have Power Badminton as a official event. So um, if I can win a medal, especially a gold medal, I will make some history in my life. Then when I'm getting old, when I'm six, 60 years old, lie on my bed, I can still get my gold medals and think of my life. Oh, I have no regret to spend all my time to, into Power of Badminton. And I always remind myself that we need to do a good show in Paralympic. We need to show to everyone that Power of Badminton is a sport worth to keep itself in Paralympic longer and longer. We know that now we are in Paralympic for 2020 in Tokyo and also 2024 in Paris. So what about 2020 in New York and then 2032? So we, I, I hope that personally, Power, Power Badminton can be stay as long as it can in Paralympic. And then to let more effort to come into our sport to develop better and then we can stay longer. That's it for this episode of Badminton Unlimited. But join us again next week for more stories from across the globe. Did Bei Wen Chang's Chinese cooking class turn out to be a success or a kitchen disaster? And we travel to Switzerland to see how badminton is growing thanks 
to one club's determination. In the meantime, remember to log on to bwfbabington.com for the latest news and features on the sport. Bye-bye, be safe and wash your hands.